Hello and welcome back to another vlog. This is an exciting one. This is an exciting what? I'm Annika. Oh yeah, I was about to say that. Okay. I'm Jenica. I'm Annika. And today we're getting our freaking ears pierced. We're getting our freaking ears pierced. I'm nervous. Oh, fun. I'm getting my third hole. I wanted, I like didn't want my second hole pierced for forever. And then one day I was like, I could wear more earrings if I had more holes. So I immediately went and got my ears pierced with Madison. Actually, <laughs> done um, just a few years ago, actually. And now I need more. I can't wear another. Like I want a stud or something. We're going to studs. We are going to studs. And we are partnering with them on Instagram. So definitely to go check out our giveaway over there. What are you what are you thinking? What's your vibe? I have not had my ears pierced since birth. Yeah, I will say the last time that she got her ears pierced. You know I like when her... you get to you get to pick when you're going red. That's when interesting. You... <laughs> When you get to pick your American Girl doll, you can ask mm -hmm. if you want their ears pierced. And of course she said yes for me. And that's how I got my ears pierced. That's not, you weren't my American Girl doll. It's a funny reference. It was a funny reference. Yeah, so I guess I've just so. never like, it's just always been there. For my 15th birthday, I was like, okay, she's six months old. She's ready for her ears to be pierced. And so I took her to the local Walmart where you get your ears pierced in my neck of the woods. And when we got there, I couldn't sign to get her ears pierced because I was not 18. And I was like, but this one's mine. Like this is my child. I. I I said yeah and they said your mom's no. gonna have to come sign so my mom had to come up and sign to get her ears pierced but guess what guess who's signing today this girl here had to upload my id and everything well i'm kind of nervous i know it's it is kind of i've been trying not to think about it because it is pretty nerve-wracking and i don't i don't love needles you don't I have, you I won't have be a really big them. fear of it that doesn't help do you want to go first so you don't like seeing like you're not Probably. or do you need to see the process no, i think i, I need think to go he, first. yeah yeah your makeup looks really good and glowy oh thanks oh she got a facial this week and it looks awesome <sighs> I really, really needed good. it. Okay, we're in downtown Nashville, and there's people are out and about. Well, it's it's seventy noon, degrees it's in February. Sixty eight degrees. I put, was putting this sweater on, and I was like, I need to like make sure I'm not like too late because I didn't want to wear like a sweater and then another jacket. I knew it wasn't like maybe I'm that toasty. cold. So I checked the weather, and at ten o'clock this morning, it was already like fifty eight, and I was like, that's weird. Looked, it is it's sixty eight degrees right now. Well, it still is February. Like it's supposed to be still be cold and chilly. February. I do want to just I want to put my heart out to those girlies that are that have the aesthetic of pink and red and sparkly and valentine's and love and hearts everywhere because i mean it's two times a year for me it's during halloween everything's just so cute there's like black cats, like it's just so cats. cats like it's so cool and then freaking valentine's day i'm gonna put my heart out to the february girlies who are going to nationals <gasps> It's Nationals Month. It's Nationals Month. I can't believe it's been a I whole year. I can't believe I'm not going. You could. You can go stay with Sam. Y'all go for a day. Don't tell me that. <laughs> like, don't tell me that. You know I would go. She would think Sophia. that it was so fun, too. She I loves popping out of her. surprise, Sophia. Being there, you just, you feel like you're and on I the bring it on me, maybe. I won't miss a lot of, like, crazy weekends because all the girls are going to be in Florida. But from buying dresses, they're not going to be buying dresses. They're going to be in Florida. That. You could be onto something. We're not going to do configuring right now. We're gonna we're You're gonna get gonna, on yeah. over to. It's a beautiful day, seriously. Beautiful so day. we were like gonna just come get our ears pierced and like go home. But now I'm thinking I like want. I'm been craving a poke bowl, and so I'm really thinking they've got a good one in here. It'll be easier. It's so hilarious that I've been literally meaning to go to Sephora for forever, and I finally just grabbed other drugstore stuff because I wasn't going to Sephora anytime soon. There's a Sephora here, but I don't think I need anything now. I like my little elf brow pencil that I got. And if Free People has the cherry blossom sweatpants, I'm getting them. If Free People has that blue hat that I have been regretting. Getting, not getting that's the, that's i'm gonna get that if they have the cherry blossom sweatpants I'm gonna get yeah okay that's fair yeah shake on it my hand's sweaty <laughs> i'm sorry are you not nervous <laughs> turn the air conditioner on are you i told okay? you i'm toasty <laughs> You got a little, you need a fall set. Uh -huh, right I have them over here too. Oh my gosh, you guys, that is, are you, like, it's, it like is it's okay. It's glistening. Yeah, it is okay. I mean, it's, obviously it's nervous, but it, <laughs> it doesn't hurt. It's nerve wracking. It doesn't hurt. Well, I mean, it hurts, like, as it, much she's as that would. She's done this new thing lately where she's, like, trying to tell me it's okay, but, like, also it's like, acknowledging, lately. acknowledging the reasons it's not okay. Like, when I get my pop tire, she's like, it's okay. Nothing's wrong at all. You do have a pop tire, but, like, and then I was like, it doesn't hurt except for a little bit. It's not that bad. Uh, just a tiny. You know, I'm always just a glass half full kind of girl. I gotta get out of the car and start walking or I'm gonna start crying, okay? So we have got to go. We have got okay. to go. Okay, let's go get our ears pierced.
Okay, let's see. I think that I wait. Which one did you do? The, the heart and which one? Heart. Just the heart. Um, yeah, I'm on both. Okay, so those. Okay. okay. I would like want to do something like this. Yeah. Here, we'll see. The thing is, this one can sit long ways, like this. Yeah. Like up and down, so you can yeah. see how okay. Yeah, so like that's that curl. Cool. And I have that, I have that jerk, like I have the drop one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's look at that one. So I can do it kind of like, yeah, that's yeah. cute. It brings in the pearl of these two. That'd be good then. You add yes. a shine and then you have it. So they're push pants, so you just snap off. Annie is losing her mind. I'm not, I just say. You're not losing your mind? I am. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. But like, so, I guess when I just like can, I'm just gonna snap a drink on. No more transitions. It's funny, you're done. Perfect. I know, like, oh, cute. So cute. Yeah. Can you take a look at the bigger mirrors too? They pass you both together. They're really cute. Now it's time for me to start processing. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so glad that's over. Where do I need to go in my mind? Where can I to, like, go? Yeah, they're just three words I have. What story can I tell myself? It's so cute, you guys. Do you love it? I love it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. Cute, cute. How cute is that? Hello. Hello. We came in our one of our favorite vintage stores. Look at this. Yeah, Look at this. Everywhere. This needs to be worn with pride. I kind of actually do love this Jeff Gordon jersey, low key. Look how cool it looks. Look at his airbrush. Oh my god. Just like some jeans and Yeah. Oh, Tyler's boyfriend. It's only $22. <laughs> $22. I'm Look at this Georgetown one we found. It's Nike, but it's like felt. It's so cool. It's like, do I get this or no? <laughs> I mean, no. It's so cool. Taylor might like it. Monica's contemplating. It literally looks cute with what you have on. The wall of hot sauce, please. Please, there's my guy. And there's my girl. Oh my gosh, you got chili lime? <gasps> Eat. We usually go just to this is called the assembly hall. And it's both sides. If you guys ever come here, honestly, this is the place to eat for sure. A lot of like Nashville local places have spots in here. So there's this side and this side, and you just use that little walkway over there. We always go. But to we it. have never and tried every time we leave there and walk past here. We say we need to try that sometime. I know. And this is really the perfect day to like sit outside. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Look at these crispy rice, you guys. They look great, huh? Look Don't <laughs> Don't be scared of me, my <laughs> excitement for crispy rice. You, you, you thought it was B-roll? Yeah, I wasn't ready. I was like, oh, okay. How do you feel after your piercing? Oh, don't even know they're there. Yeah. I'm sure if I yanked my ear out like you did, I would know she went. On so, accident. I think I'm fine. Look at our view, you guys. I think she just said, I don't know why we hadn't come here before. I couldn't tell you. This is our this favorite is kind of food, too. Samoa? Samoa? This is like honestly the best donuts in Nashville, I would say. Is this the is this the king? The queen? Yeah. 
this takes the crown. All right, we're saying goodbye. On to the next. Well, we're making our way back to the car, and at lunch, I did realize I don't know that I turned the car off. No, here's what happened. Let me tell you. So I got a notification. Thanks for visiting this parking lot. And oh also, my gosh, when we were staying at the one, that that would have been so nice. That dog park. Yeah, right there. we just found a dog park. Oh. Um, so I got a notification that I only get really when I drive out. It might be when I drive out, or it might be when the time expires. Yeah. We are you about to find out? Expires. But then I was like, but did you turn the car off? And She's I was like, like I, don't. I think so. I'm sorry, what? I'm not used to push the start. That's fancy. When was the last time you drove your car? I'm lucky not seeing your car. <laughs> Take the camera. <laughs> Oh, no, there it is, there it is, there it is. It's just a baby over there. Yes, there it is, there it is. <laughs> now, is it on? Is the question? Good news. She is off. And still here. <laughs> got some more disposables. These are months old. I couldn't tell you. I think you. that one of them is from Vlogmas, but I don't know what they're from. Oh. Okay, Where wait. did you hide them from me? Because I'm trying to get them out. We can't look at these because this shows all of them. So oh my we'll god, that's so cute. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh my god. Jane, that's so cute. Y'all took y'all were with us when we took this. Look how it turned out when we were watching Home Alone decorating. Wait, I'm, I've not seen these. Go back, go back, go back. Ish, these are just nature ones. Oh, fun. I took some at the mine and Haley's walk. I, I was like, I think I have four more pictures, girl. I need to take these. Oh, look at us. So How cute. pretty. Look at Radner. Oh, look at the animals. Oh my gosh, look at us. That's a great photo. This is a great photo. Oh, this one is too. Wait, it's crazy to see us not looking because we like look alike now. I feel like. Ah! Let me see. <gasps> Wait, we didn't even get this one's so cute. We didn't even get this good of a picture. Like these are. <gasps> and this one is no, so this one is cute. So it has cute. like all of the Toy Story stuff in the background and, and the I'm popcorn. Just, like, casual. Oh, this this might be my fave. Look at my girls. It's you and your girl. Look how fun. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! Look at Maddie. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god, these are great. I can't wait to send them in these to them. Oh, oh my gosh, stop. I love him. Hibachi chef. Look at him. He jumped in this one. How fun. I said, get in this picture with us. Him cooking. Oh my oh, god. This is such a good that one. That one is so good. Cute with your aunt. My aunties. How many photos do you have with these girls? I you mean, know, your whole. Oh. Is that all oh. of us? Or is it you? This is really cute. Look. Look at us. That one's really cute. Yeah. Eh? Look how cute this is. Oh, You're it's all just sitting girls. in our chair. Like me and my girls. Some, like somebody's, one of our kids is going to yeah. show this photo and be like, this is our mom's on like their college reunion trip. They always took. Oh, these are cute. Oh, they always take. We'll still be taking them. Fun. Look, this, I took this ah! one on camera too. Oh, Aaron's tour. Aaron's tour movie. Okay, Vlogmas. We must have gotten something on the film. Ah! Oh. Oh. No, I hope we didn't. No, dang. Sorry, girl. <gasps> 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 Look at the shoes. Look at the shoes. The way they, the flash caught those. Okay, what the heck? When did we take? <laughs> Look how fun that is. Look at these two guys. My pants look good. Look at like just pants. like everything. The plaza in the back. Everything. <gasps> no, I'm obsessed with this one. Stop right now. I'm going to actually start your crying. Show them that one. Show them that one. Oh, I like this big one. I just like this one. These are so fun. Look at that's us at Bryant Park. Yep. Oh my gosh, that's Daddy's so cute. Look at this, how fun. Cute. Hello. Look how fun. Oh, these are gonna make me cry this Christmas. Look at Tane. Oh, this one's better. Oh my gosh, she looks like a freaking model. Look at her. This might be one of my new favorite pictures of her, to be totally honest. Look at that. That's good. Oh, I like that one too. I took a picture of the vlog. That's cute. Oh, and this, <laughs> this is one? you guys. You were <laughs> It actually turned out kind of cute. This one's cute. Oh, look at you on the tree! Look at you on the ladder! This is us decorating for our last Christmas here. I'm gonna freak out and cry. Tears. So cute! 
I don't want the end. Seven, we just went through 72 pictures. No, no, that was 15 tops. How freaking cute the is Disney that? The Disney ones are so cute. Yeah, get back to the Disney one. Honestly, the nature ones turned out crazy. We need to take that to the yeah. park the next time we go. Those are so good. Which one was your favorite? The graduation ones? I think maybe, yeah. I mean, they are crazy good. Look yeah. at these, you guys. Like, they are... I love this one of you. Do you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is cute. We use the Canon SureShot Tele 80 for our disposable camera. Sure do. Sure do. And we obviously freaking love it. Here you go. Do we want to do a taste test or no? Oh yeah, we want to do a taste test. Okay. We got freaking five dollars and they have minis now so you can like try more than one. Okay, the one is a lot. One is a lot. It's like, it's it's perfect split for like a little snack, but if you split more than one, like you're full and we don't want to... Okay. They'll upload to my account. Like the next hour. Oh, yeah, they'll be. They get on digital, um, digital and we go to what's it called? Safe Light Imaging in Nashville. Tell them what we got. We got a mini Samoa. We got a mini birthday cake. And we got a big size cinnamon cream cheese. Do you want to take a bite of the cinnamon cream cheese so you're done with it? No, I don't want any of the cinnamon cream cheese. Work for me. Samoa is crazy. crazy. Okay, I think I want to do a birthday cake first because I want Samoa um, last. Okay. Oh, period. Just pick it up and take what you want out of it. Oh, you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Crazy. That's crazy. There's a hundred layers. Oh, They're so famous much. for their There's croissant 100. style hundred layer donuts. Hundred layers. One hundred. One hundred layers. <gasps> mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, you guys look. And there's like cream coming out this. Look at that. This is like a seasonal special one. Okay. It's mid. Mm -hmm. It's mid. I think I was expecting more flavor, more like coconut, but I really like it still. Mm -hmm. That's the thing about like croissant base or like donuts like this is they really are good about Not keeping the sweet. yeah keeping the donut flavor and keeping whatever their like the topping yeah. flavor as well. Okay. Okay, Very I'm good. gonna save the other one for later. But as always, eleven out of ten. Yeah. Out you there. Yeah. What was y'all's favorite picture? Let us know. Let us know. We'll post them on IG too. Oh, you best know it. You best believe it. You best believe it, because I'm, if not one, two. I'm, we're almost at the point where we just need to make an account for our film photos. Mm -hmm. You know, and so we can post all of them. Okay. We are off to the PARK. Would you like to go on a walk? Would you like to go on a walk? Would you like to go to the park? Let's go to the park. Come on. Thanks for letting me use your bed as a tripod. Hold on. What are you doing over here? You ready? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Does the sneeze mean yes? What's that?
I love when you catch them at like right before sunset so you get the full thing and then you get in the car once the sunset is complete. That was just perfect. Now it's dark outside, which it's now like six o'clock, but I thought I did drop Annika off before the walk. I dropped Annika off at work. She is helping. I mean, it's just prom season. And so they're like, go, go, go. And they're getting boxes in and boxes in and boxes in every day. She was going to dinner with one of the girls anyway that she works with. And so she just got dropped off there. She'll come home later tonight, but I wanted to give you a studs haul, you guys. Obviously, I don't remember my very first ear piercing because I was 17 days old. You heard that correctly, not even a month which it should have been two. I mean, I am all for this. Like, go ahead and get them needles in my ears. Like, I appreciate you, gal. Thank you. So I don't remember this guy. Now, this guy also does. If you were a child in the probably 90s and then before that, 80, 70s, 80s, 90s, if you're a child in the South, your mom had pageant earrings on you or like just crazy big huge earrings since three years old so like I have I call them pageant ears because we all like the, the pageant girlies wore these crazy crazy heavy earrings at like 10 so my earlobes are not too bad but they are um split do have to pay attention to kind of what the weight of any earring that goes in this front hole which is great advice you should probably be doing anyway but i never thought that i wanted my second hole like for forever i i have under my tongue pierce which if you don't know about that and that sorry that's a that's a shocker anyway we're not going to talk about that anymore i was a different person back then this is who i i you know what though i do like it i really do love it it's just a part of me and it's been a part of me for over 10 years and it's just who i am back to my ears for some reason i just like never thought i wanted my second hole and then one day it clicked with me and i was like i have to have the second hole like i need more earrings maddie and i were at warby parker's grand opening in the green hills mall and um we said let's just go to claire's and get our ears pierced so we did that and i got my second hole and immediately i was like i should have done this years ago like this is the best thing this is the best thing and so ever since then i've wanted my third but Annika really, ha like, she has so much FOMO with, like, more things she wants done. And I just wanted her to be older before she did anything like that. So, now she's older and she can make those decisions. Now, we're still waiting until 18 for tattoos and things like that. Like, any bodily changes like that. Like, I'm not going to allow. The second hole of the ear pierce. I don't think she's going to, like, start rebelling or anything. Uh, they're little pink crystal hearts. <laughs> so, we've really, really been wanting to get these piercings for forever. And we, we were going to do it during Vlogmas. And it just got, like, it just came. And we were just talking today, like, December 1st does feel like six months ago but also literally feels like yesterday i'm like what did we even wh how, what did we even do for like we're just on overdrive all of december that it's nice to like come down after and like realize all the things we did okay anyway we did not get around to this and i'm so glad that we did we did work with studs i've worked with them before and so i reached out and i was like hey i know you guys got a location in nashville we love you can we stop by and get our ears pierced and they were like absolutely come on in so we also got to leave with a pair let me see. The ear piercing experience there genuinely was, like we're not working with them on YouTube. This is not sponsored. It was perfection. Like she just so knew what she was doing. She said she's been doing this for two years and they like had piercings out the door. So like who knows how many ears she does a day. I don't, that's what I was getting to a thousand years ago. I don't remember what my first hole was. Obviously I do, I do think it was a needle. Second one was definitely Claire's gun. And I remember having to like really tentatively like take care of it and twist it and, and do all these things. This one was a needle and it like hurt wise. Like obviously it's a ran out of SD card space cause I was gapping too much. Haven't gotten to the point. What I'm trying to say was obviously it's a needle going through your freaking ear. Okay. But it's, it's a sensation. You really kind of don't feel anything for a second. When she changes it out, it's the pull and tug is kind of like, oh, oh, that kind of doesn't feel great. And then it's over. And then like I, I accidentally grabbed and like touched. I can't talk about it. I can't talk about it. I turned red and I was like, are you okay? Are you going to pass out? I haven't felt any sort of anything. Like I don't even... It does not feel like I got my answer today. It's the craziest thing. So, love it. They have so many locations. That I think they only do piercings at some, but they, they do piercings over 13 with parental, you know, signatures before then. Okay, this one is mine. We got this mist. How cool is this? I can't, I know you had to have like the Q-tip and all this stuff. This is a freaking mist. Let's actually see how it works. I can go ahead and mist away. So it is, oh, that nail med. This is what Annika uses for her sinus rinses. <laughs> it says piercing aftercare fine mist. This all came with the piercing. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. Watch 
wash it say like, wait, 24 hours to spray on. This is what I got. I guess I got one and a half pairs technically. This is exciting. This is exciting. Oh my gosh. After five studs purchases, you get a free gift. Sometimes. I mean, honestly, I have my whole collection of studs. Really, truly, again, this is not an ad. Ever since I got my first pair of like chunky gold hoops with them and the fun little dangly ones with the charms that I love, I've genuinely, I've not worn pairs of earrings like consistently like this ever again. They're just so good and they don't tarnish and they, she was telling me today, I knew, I should have known this. They're like built very, very, very lightweight. So again, my pageant ears that I was just telling you guys about, this is not a problem with most of the studs pairs, even my big chunky ones because they do have just a lighter feel to them. Look how cute these freaking guys are. So they're smaller, but they're really chunky. I love them. I love them. So these are going to be like such, this is more of my like every day. I keep these in. These are actually also studs. I'll show you. Let me maybe not rip earrings out of my ears with freaking new piercings. So cute. It's little pearls and it's gold and it's like an oval shape. I love it. They're, they are really small. Like I sleep with these. Okay. Number one, my face freaked out after New York. I don't know, it just freaked out. And it's like not even really, I mean, there's breakouts, but like it, I had like dry spots. I don't have eczema, so I don't wanna like throw that word out there. I had so many dry spots all over my face. You can still see the remnants of some of them. Anyway, over here, we've got, of course, the one I just showed you. This one is so pretty. It comes in silver and gold, and the silver is so pretty too. But it's like little opals. I can't at all see what's going on. But again, if you see like water, it's the mist. Is this anywhere in the right? Is it in focus? This one's got a little rose. She's so cute. I always have something with a charm. This one is actually a charm that Annika has on her earrings that she wears every day. So I thought that was really cute to get that like matching. This is the first one Annika saw. I was like, mom, you knew this. And I saw it again and I was like, you know what? I think I actually do. It's so cute. It's a little silver and gold together. Like, oh yeah, there we go. There's the gold side, silver side. It's so cute. It's kind of a thicker like huggy. So you could for sure wear this in your first hole, but I'm gonna put it in this side on my second hole. I wanna change next. Okay, next we'll show you. Oh, every time you get studs, they come with this whole little package and it's got stickers, your little punch card and, and a little studs care card. Here's AJ, she got two of these. These are just so AJ. How gorgina. Oh, there we go. It's, it's so pretty. It's, they're like these little teardrop shape. And they're in the most beautiful silver. So cute. These are called the Pear Charm Hucky. Let me see what mine were called. And again, Anna got two of those, but those would be really cute as like a separate, different second hole one. Mine were called Chunky Crescent Hoop. And if there's multiple sizes, it's definitely like a small, the small one. And then Two Tone Chunky Huggy. So that was so much fun and I'm so glad we finally, finally have that done. If pushing your ears has been on your to-do list, maybe that's a 2024 first thing we get done off the list. Okay, next up. This is PR. Papyrus sent me a freaking DM, okay? And ask if they could send me things because they saw our 2024 goal planning and setting and said, we saw you wanted to send more cards. Can we help you out? And I said, And if you watched last vlog, we literally just got Annika's Valentine's card from them at Target. Okay. We're looking at literally every single one. Okay. Shut up. Look how cute this is. Like, how am I not supposed to want to frame that somewhere? And I really honestly can. Look at those little, look at the, look at this. Look at it. Look at it. I mean, you can't tell me that you, you wouldn't open, pull this out of an envelope and go, oh my gosh. Jenica, you didn't think we forget your birthday. Hope you had the best time at NYC. Cheers to the best year yet. Well, I love you. Again, someone could, oh my gosh. Are you, uh, are you fully kidding? Are you saying this? Who is even worthy of this birthday card? Like, what? Oh, this has to go to somebody. I no, I'm gonna freak out. Okay, listen, if you are a parent that has seen how happy your child can be at Disney, or if you are not a, an, an adult that needs to look after that inner child sometime, you can sit back. Going to Disney with my child fully changed who I am. 
and I don't care if Annika is like 40. I still think that like seeing her at Disney will just like never not make me emotional and just so happy. It's just so healing and happy being there. I don't even, I want to frame this in a little black frame. No, I actually want to frame this in a little black frame. That's the cute, I like classic Mickey. Like I like, I like what the classic guy. Oh, Annika might have to give this to one of her sisters. No. You guys, I hope that this doesn't, I, I really hope that when I'm opening PR, it like doesn't seem dramatic. One, first of all, actually, I am dramatic. I'm a dramatic person. Literally asked, the, not even my preschool teacher, asked the person that kept me as an infant when my mom went back to work at six weeks or whatever. Like I have been max extra since day one. So this is genuine, this is gen- and, and, and you would have the same reaction if people see you stuff like this, this is- I have no choice but to send cards out. That's, that's honestly, this is what you need to do. You need to go to your favorite like little card shop. Downtown Franklin has so many places. Obviously Target carries these now. Go pick your budget and go just get the cards. Get a couple that say congratulations, get a couple that say thank you, get a couple that say happy birthday, and it makes you want to send them out. And you don't have to go to the store once you realize, oh, so-and-so's birthday's tomorrow. Like, you have stuff on hand. <sighs> I can't handle many more rhinestones. Look at her. I pop up. I pop up. Let's just see. Let's see. Because I, I was almost like, oh, I don't need to open these. And I was like, well, you're gonna have to open them when you send them. Oh my gosh, it comes with like a seal. Oh, that's so cute. So the seal that was on mine, let's see it. <gasps> comes with all of them. Oh, that's a sleigh. That is a sleigh, especially if it's going in a gift, you don't have to lick or do anything. This is truly a work of art. Look at this. You want a piece of cake? Sorry, it's my card, I have to go, but the cake's over there. Come on, is this for real? I'm gonna burst into tears at some point. I really am. Sometimes I just can't handle things. This is the sweetest thing. And I'm like at this point in life where this is happening to me a lot. I mean, four of my best friends literally gave birth within a month of each other last year. Look at this. Look at this. Congratulations. My boy. Look at the little string. The hanger is hanging on a little string. No. The bows. I'm, I, I, I honestly am trying not to show y'all all of them. Look how cute. Look how cute. The bows. The bows are real, y'all. The bows are real. The colors on this? Are you kidding? Oh my gosh. It literally, look, 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 look. What's that fruit that looks like this? Look at that. Look at that. I'm gonna let Annika pick out a couple of these and, uh, Maybe this will be one of the ones that she picks out because are we kidding? Are we kidding? The whole card. It's like this linen embroidered masterpiece. $8.95, $8.95. And for this to be a, quite literally a work of art, I mean, you actually could like gift a frame with this and frame this. I'm not kidding, I'm, I'm not kidding. Oh, this is so funny. Look how cute. And you know, brothers, they're easily impressed. They'd be like, oh, look at this. Thanks, sis. <laughs> oh my God, is there another card? Hello? Oh my gosh, the inside matches. The inside matches. I bet this is like a set you can get. We hope you enjoyed this little surprise. Your goal of sending birthday cards in 2024 made us so happy. Our team looks forward to kept keeping up with you and Annika throughout the year. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. You guys, oh. This makes me want to go water my orchid right now. Oh, look at this. It reminds me of a time when my orchid was bloomed. It's beautiful. It's like it's like this shiny iridescent paper. It's like layered on top. Grant, I know you're watching this, but like you're gonna have to get this at some point. So act surprised when this shows up at your front door, okay? And also you can go ahead and act surprised when this one shows up at your front door too, because. I mean, you're the first person I thought of when I saw that. This is precious. No, my dad's gonna love this. 
Wow. And in the inside, oh, it says what it says on the inside. Sediment inside. Is that how you say that? Sediment? Sediment? Please don't, please don't make fun of me. I, I rarely talk to people. I have little human interaction, okay? Sometimes my words get lost. I haven't said some of these since 2019, okay? Pre-pandemic, Jenica. It, that was a long time ago. Anyway, wishing you a perfect day filled with all the things that would make you happy. Have a wonderful birthday, Dad. Cute! Oh no, look how cute this is. Wait, this looks like a little maybe bookmark or something? How cute! Oh my gosh. Here's to the sweetest and most magical birthday ever. With the unicorn. We're gonna be here a minute. We're gonna be here a minute. We are, we are. Remember when I said I can't handle more rhinestones? Remember when I said I can't handle many more rhinestones? These are about to do me in. These, these are about to do me in. Oh, he's got a bouquet of flowers, don't worry about it. Lots of love and a special wish for a perfect day from beginning to end. Oh, I love the flowers on that. That actually would be a beautiful real life cake. Blank inside. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful this is. They're literally little works of art. They are quite literally little works of art. A gift bag? I shouldn't have. How thoughtful of me. Why does this, this makes me want to give this to my brother for some reason. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. There's been so many times that like neighbors have helped me out that I've genuinely needed to run back in here, write something down, just a little thank you, and, and throw a little Target gift card in there, or not, or just literally be like, thank you so much, and stick it at their door. There's been truly so many times that I've wanted something like that. This is just perfect. This is, this is perfect. Oh my gosh, stop. Here is a few more birthday ones. They're so, look at, look at how cute. The pom-poms, you guys. Oh, wait, another birthday one. Wait, I guess this could be, we just make a wish. How cute. Do I need to say much more, honestly? Oh, are there like stores of this? Or is it just a brand? Let me see. Ooh, okay, so on their website, you can put in your zip code and it tells you like a list of all of the retailers they have near you. Okay, that's nice to know. The bags have rhinestones on them too. Look at, I mean, imagine showing up to a freaking birthday party like this, you guys. Honestly, you're the coolest person there. Done, it's that easy. Donuts, look at the tag. To you, from me. This is the cutest thing in the world. This is the cutest thing in the world. I might, I, I wasn't gonna get a bag for Annika's Valentine's Day stuff, but now I feel like I have to use this bag and this paper that this came in, obviously. So I guess she will be getting a bag. This is iconic. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I genuinely was expecting maybe three cards and a this. You know what I mean? This makes me so excited. I want to honestly just put a piece of paper over this and I'll reuse it. I'll keep it for Annika or somebody. <laughs> like this, this can't, I have to keep this forever. Okay, as I'm putting them back, I am gonna find my favorite. Well, I'm probably gonna have to do a top three. I need to like organize my, how am I gonna organize my cards? I was successfully able to narrow it down to a top six. Best I can do. Best I can do is a top six. First and foremost, we have this girl. It's just too cute, you know? I know that it doesn't have as many glitz and glam of a lot. Of, what am I saying? This is the pop-up one. She earned her spot in the top six. There will be no further explanation. This is one of the ones. You know I was gonna do that. You can't put that much glitter on something and expect me not to put it in the top, whatever. Again, self-explanatory. Self-explanatory, you can't do anything New York and not expect me to include it in the top. And especially, making it black and white, or I guess gray, and adding glitter. I just love it. I just love it. It's so simple, yet truly, I found myself actually just staring at it. It's so cool. The whole entire thing is fabric and embroidered. Come on, how could it not? Earned her spot. And lastly, number six, which this wasn't in any particular order. Don't make me do that. 
Thank you so much, Papyrus. I will leave their website linked in the description and you can type in your zip code to see. I'll actually just leave that page linked directly in the description to be, for you to be able to type in your zip code and see where they are near you. You guys, this is so exciting. Who We've got to figure out who has February birthdays because I know I have some February birthdays and we got to get this going. We got to get the show on the road. Good morning. We're doing a face mask this morning. My skin is still, it's so, I mean, obviously we're in like the middle of winter. So like, I guess not technically the middle. I've got dry skin. So I've not done one of these guys in forever. It comes with this and, oh, this is the rubber mask. So this is like the serum that like usually is like built into sheet mask. You put this on and then you put the rubber mask on it. This has been in the fridge. I bought it in New York and then ended up not getting to wear it. So first we take this guy and just apply it all over. We're using every drop. Oh, we need to be hydrated for sure down here. Ooh, right here's dry. My forehead's not too shabby. It's like mainly right around my mouth and my nose, which makes sense for the cold. <laughs> my eyebrows are like funky, you know? Mm. Honestly, this feels so good. Oh my God, is this one of the ones that doesn't have a mouth? Okay. Ooh. Oh, I ripped it. And now it just fits my widow speak. Okay, perfect. Now I'm ready for the masquerade ball. Oh, God, this just makes you I freaking feel better about life. Like, I genuinely already feel better. We're gonna have a good day. Okay, now we leave on for like 30 minutes. B R B. Okay, it's been about 30 minutes. It's probably been a little bit long. Oh, oh my God. I'm just gonna make sure it's all kind of even. All right, I gotta do something about these brows. I get these little guys from Amazon. They are like singular lash and brow spoolies. And I love that they come with a cover because I keep one in my purse at all times too. They come in like a pack of like literally 100 or 50 or something. So I've yet to run out, but I love keeping them on hand. Speaking of spoolies, I actually also love, love, love these guys. These are silicone, so they can they clean really easy and they last forever. I bought a pack of these, I think like 100, when we lived at the old apartment in like 2019. And I still have more than three-fourths of the bag just because they last for so, so long. I like these because these are a little bit more precise. But I, I, keep, I have both in my bathroom drawer and my vanity. But in my purse, I just keep these guys because it's covered. This one is the one that I use like most for like makeup and stuff. Just because it really is. The silicone just allows it to be a little bit more precise. Time to clean our makeup brushes. We don't do this as often as we should, you know, but it is what it is. Okay, what we're gonna do, I used to use a specific makeup brush cleanser, but it was really alcohol based and I saw TikTok that was like, hey, let's not use these kinds. And it was literally one of the ones that I was using. So I was like, that does check out, that does check out. So we're back to the dom, baby. I'm just using some dish soap. Before I used the solution, I was using micellar water, but I just don't have any of that. So I just have this full of soapy water and then this will like actually clean it. I have one of those pads somewhere, but this works just something that's just textured that's gonna actually like get in there and clean the brushes. And then kind of rinse them downwards with the, with the brush. And I'm just gonna do that a couple times already looking better. I of course have my iPad in here and while we're doing this, I'm gonna watch some of my show that I have found. I don't know if anybody else's For You page is like this, but every now and then my For You page will like show me like TV shows and it'll be like little snippets. And there's this one that I've seen like several snippets of. And the first few times I was like, this just doesn't seem like anything I'd be interested in. And then I fell for a couple of the like, you know, you click on part one, then you go watch part two, three, what? And I was like, this show doesn't seem half bad. And I recently, after I got done watching um, John Wick, I was in like another show hall. It's that time where you finish your show and you gotta find something else, it's just brutal. And I'm no stranger to that feeling. So I like to have shows with multiple seasons. And when I finally looked up the show, I was like, oh my gosh, there's seven or eight seasons and it only came out in like 2020 or something. So I was like, obviously it's good. I've seen a couple clips that I've you know enjoyed let's just check it out and I'm like hesitant because it it kind of gives 
from the trailers that I watched, it kind of gave like Riverdale vibes. And at the end of the day, like I am a 32 year old woman. So like, should I be watching like little high school shows again? Yes. And it's not even a little high school show. It's not, it's so good. It's called The 100. And it's about a hundred people that were sent from, okay, no wait. End of the world, apocalypse, world, bombs, and uh, done, okay? There's a ship in space called the Ark that like different nations were on. And so they survived the end of the world, but now like their oxygen's running out. They have to like figure out what they can, if they can go back to earth. So they send a hundred people down to earth and it's like, goes from there and you know I loved The Last of Us like that was one of the that's one of my favorite series I've watched like of 2023 was The Last of Us so I'm so excited that they're doing a season two so it kind of gives like that vibes but just a little bit like, this has a little bit more like a fantasy twist to it whereas well I guess not really I have really 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 been enjoying it and I could keep like making fun of me because she'll walk in my room or wherever I am and I like won't even look up from my tv or computer and whatever I'm watching it on because I'm so invested it's just really good it like has me like rooting for couples and stuff which I don't normally do like I am all in it is really 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 good and it has a really good plot like it's art I'm already on season three and they've like been able to keep the same like it's you, you know how sometimes you can tell like oh that didn't really plan past seasons one or two and this one just so is so cohesive and really really good so i'm gonna catch up in my show i've got a lot of editing i need to do today other than that we're going to finish these brushes watch my show i like to change the water after every few brushes because lovely flesh colored water that is so fun Okay, more so. girl who knows that I like to be tan but I don't really like care I'm not as I, I spray tan genuinely only on special occasions there is sometimes I look in the mirror in the dead of winter though and I go that's your winter color girl I mean that is I, I honestly wanted to tell y'all no I'm not sick because I kind of look a little bit sick anyway Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. We are doing something very, very fun in the next one, so get excited. I, you know, 2024, I said was gonna be a hobby year, and I was gonna start doing things because I liked to do them. And we are home making some candles. I have got my scents picked out. If you guys have any tips of any, any fellow candle makers, let me know some tips. If you have any guesses on what flavor, if you know me, you know what flavor was the first one that I, flavor, scent, scent. You know what scent I purchased first. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.